welcome to the Spiritual Centre. I'm Sonia Parker and in this video I'm going to be doing a pick a card reading with messages from your angels. If the reading resonates with you, please let me know in the comments. If not, then maybe to take a look at my other pick a card readings which are in the description. Okay, so if we look on the table, we have three groups of cards. Group one, group two, and group three. And what I'd like you to do is take a look at those cards and see which group that you're drawn to. Set your intention. What message do I need to hear from my angels right now? As you focus on the cards, take a deep breath in. Really concentrate. And feel what number you are drawn to. Either one, two, or three. One, two, or three. I'll just leave you for a second to connect. Okay, so let's move group two and three for now. And here we have and here we have group one. So let's look at what your angels have for you right now. Okay, these lovely cards. So here is your pick a card angel reading group one and here is your first card which is your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. This is the angel of clearing. Your time of waiting and confusion will be soon over. So the angels are working hard to clear your aura, to remove any blockages, to realign your auric field and your chakras, to bring balance and harmony. It's almost as though your future is going to be much clearer. It's almost as though there's a fog or a haze for some of you right now about what you need to do or where you're heading. So over the next few days, you're going to feel that sense of peace, that sense of harmony, that sense of balance. And give thanks to the angels for this beautiful gift. Acknowledge their presence. Know that blessings are coming your way and it is thanks to your angels. Also think about the changing seasons of life and know that you will experience those same changes. Everything goes through that cycle, that pattern. The ups, the downs, the goods, the bads, the extremes of emotions, the extremes of feelings. Life always continues and you will grow because of all the experiences that you've had and been through. Life is always an ebb and a flow and there is always an exchange of energy. Beautiful card, very, very light, the pinks and the purples. Okay. The next card that we have for you, for your angel messages, is from Archangel Michael. And the message that he has for you right now, again, is pinks and purples with a touch of gold. And it's exactly the same colours as the previous card. And the message he has is patience. He wants to tell you that there is no rush. There is no need to hurry. Hurry. 
You don't need to force things to happen. And also I'm being given the power of three. So I've got the triangles, the pyramids. And I'm given the power of three. And know that you can manifest anything with this number. And I'm being given three words, stop, look and listen. Be aware of what's going on around you, the behaviour of others, your own behaviour. And again, with the power of three, it's about thinking, doing and being. Thinking, doing and being. Know that the angels are assisting you right now. And in the coming days you're going to be in true alignment with your being and your true purpose as well. Things are going to be so much clearer. It's almost as though a divine light is coming through and cleansing for you as well. Okay, the final card that we have for you with your messages for your from your angels right here today is from the unicorn deck and it's number 22 openings a new door is opening for you i always feel this card is similar to 22 in the tarot which is the fall although the fall hasn't got a number he is the 22nd card of the major arcana and the 22 is about the fool's journey. So it's about taking risks and taking leaps of the leap of faith. But the angels want you to know that there is a new door opening for you. So be prepared. The angels will be opening that door for you. This could be a key to a new opportunity. It could be a new job. It could be a new relationship. It could be spiritual development. Or it could be any number of things or opportunities. It's up for you to see that opportunity. You will need to look for it. The message that is coming from the angels for you today is to look for that opportunity. As soon as you get that clarity of mind, that clear, that clearness, that fogginess, um, which they're going to clear for you, then be prepared for a new doorway to open. And if you cannot see an opportunity and you can't see anything happening, then make the opportunity for yourself. You are being given the key. It's up to you what you do with that key. You can open a new opportunity if you want to. Lovely messages, group one. Beautiful messages for you. Your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. Just have a little bit of patience. Allow them time to clear your aura, to clear any blockages in your chakras. Take time out, take some peace and quiet to allow your body to re realign. Get, spend some time out in nature. Go by the sea, into the mountains, fresh air. Let it blow out the physical as well. So that that new opening, that new doorway, that new key that you're being given, you'll be able to manifest whatever's coming your way. And take on the power of Archangel Michael. He's coming in with patience, but also he's coming in with strength as well. To take his strength and take his love. Bless you for watching. If this reading resonates with you right now, please let me know in the comments. Thank you.
And let's see what the angels have to say for you, group two. We have angel of union. A partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. We have Archangel Sandalphon and the word love. Beautiful card. And we have Mother Mary and the unicorns are blessing you. Okay, so let's have a look at the first card. The Angel of Union. A partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. So what does this mean for you right here and now? Well, a partnership or relationship of some kind is being nurtured. Now, this is with a person that you already know. This is with a person that you've already met or, or who you deal with. Um, this is not someone new coming in. This is someone you've either been in a relationship with before and they're coming back into your life. Or this is around a work situation where there's been a parting of some sort and it's a coming back together. I feel that this is a coming back together or, or whether you're with somebody and you feel like you've drifted apart. This is a, a, a rekindling, a reenactment of what got you together in the first place. Then know that this partnership, this meeting will lead you to great success. And have no doubts. It is going to continue to grow. And it will enhance the rest of your life as well. Um, and I do sense that this person is life changing for you. Now the angels are there. They're guiding. Look at the angelic love that's coming through. The angelic love is guiding you too. Whether that be within a relationship or a work situation... Know that you're being guided, a partnership that's meant to be. What a beautiful card. And the second card that we have in the messages from your angels is Archangel Sandalphon. And his message is simple. His message is love. So this person is either going to come back into your life or it's someone around you. But the love is going to grow. You can expect it to grow. And think about the love that's within you as well. Because I do feel that you get, you're you going to be giving loads of love out to the world. It's almost as though the angels are grateful for all that you do and all that you give to others. You are a true earth angel. I don't know whether you've come across that before, but that's what I'm sensing for those that have picked number two, group two. You are a true earth angel. You are empathic. You're sensitive to the emotions of others, the feelings of others. You can pick up on other people and how they're feeling. I also, you know, with clairvoyance and uh, remote viewing, you're able to see, see clearly what others are going through. And what they've been through as well. And I feel that this is kind, you already knew, but it's kind of, you needed confirmation of that. And your artistic ways are going to shine through over the next few weeks. Um, Earth Angels are very creative. They love writing, poetry, um, any way to express yourself, your own inner knowledge to share with others. So it's going to emerge. Allow it to develop as well. So allow that inner, your inner self to, to, to develop in the physical world. So that you can become the best that you can be. What a beautiful card. Okay, group two, the last card in your reading is Mother Mary. And Mother Mary and the unicorns are blessing you. These are from the Doreen, uh, Diane Cooper, sorry. 
cards. Now Mother Mary is angelic, pure love. So accept this blessing that's coming your way. Accept the love from the spirit world. Open yourself up to the divine guidance that is pouring in for you. And allow that angelic love to enlighten you on a daily basis. Allow that energy to flow through you. This is going to raise your vibration. This is going to bring you healing. This is all on offer for you. This is about rising up above any dramas that might be around you. Or any situations. This is about not allowing anyone or anything to harden your heart. This is about loving yourself first. Knowing that you're here for the good that you can bring to others. You've got beautiful cards, group two. Remember, the angel of union has that message for you. To let you know that a partnership is blessed. To let you know that two of you are destined for greatness. Whether that be a partnership of love or a partnership within a project or work situation. Two people are destined for greatness. And Archangel Sandalphon, bringing in the love from the angelic realms. Remember, you are an earth angel. That's the most important thing to come from group two. You are an earth angel. You're here to guide others on their pathway and in so, doing so you will raise your own vibration accept the love of mother mary accept the love of the angels accept the love of the archangels be filled with angelic love bless you for watching if this reading did resonate with you please let me know in the comments group three thank you for choosing this group and here is your messages from your angels and the cards that we have for you are angel of manifestation your efforts and determination and perseverance have paid off so blue it's almost as blue as the cloth that i have on the table beautiful oh, another blue one and archangel haniel Willpower. I love that word. And the last one is from the Diane Cooper Unicorn deck is number 31 Surprise. Look for the unexpected. Okay, so let's look at your three cards in a little bit more detail. Okay, so your first card is Angel of Manifestation. Your efforts determination and perseverance have paid off and the first thing that I get with this card because of the blueness is communication and I feel that the angels want to say thank you to you because of all your effort your perseverance your determination um, it's taken a lot for you to be where you are today but it's almost as though your throat chakra is coming to life. And you're going to stand up to somebody that you haven't stood up to before. I feel speaking out is really important. So although this, this is a, a card of perseverance and determination, I feel also that it's you standing your ground. And because you've stood your ground, it's going to pay off. 
And I also feel that something that you've been waiting for or wanting really badly is about to happen. So do not lose sight of your original purpose. Do not lose sight of your goal. Do not get sidetracked onto a different pathway. And do not get overexcited because good things are on the way. And I do believe that for some of you, you could have well just be at the point of where you were going to give up with someone or something. I always feel with the colour blue as well, of feeling blue or feeling down. So you could have felt as though, you know what, this isn't worth it, it's not working out. And you're just at that verge and this message has come for you today to say, hang on in there, don't give up just yet. Keep going for just a little bit longer. This could even be someone who you've had your eyes on for a while as well. Or a relationship that you thought might develop and it hasn't gone anywhere. And I feel like it could be that you don't know where you stand with this person. So this is where you need to speak out and let them know. Let them know your feelings. Because you, I can guarantee to you, when I do readings like this with the angels and the angel oracle cards, whatever you've been thinking about this person, they've been having those thoughts too. So whether there'd been any communication or not, the thoughts would have been there. Now if it's a project or a job, Know that there isn't anything else that you actually need to do. Because it will happen. No matter what the situation or what it is that you've been waiting for, it is now going to happen. What a beautiful card. Okay, your second card is Archangel Hamiel and Willpower. We have a beautiful whale. He was just about to splash his tail in the sea. Now he's bringing you that message and giving you that special gift of willpower. Bringing you strength and courage. This is about allowing the universal life force energy to flow through you. Think about how a huge whale will glide through the sea. And it would do so naturally. It does not need to force anything. Um, and I feel this is about not letting your focus slip as well. Keep having those thoughts that will bring you what you desire. Each and every day believe it is coming your way. And it's almost as though you're an actor on a stage. It's almost as though you're writing the script of what's going to happen next. So how do you want that play to end? You will have the willpower to see this one through. And see this one through to how you want it to end as well. Beautiful cards. Okay, so your last card in your reading is number 31, Surprise. Look for the unexpected today. We've also got the stag in the background and a beautiful peacock. Again, the stag offers strength. The stag will stand alone. The stag will stand on guard. Uh, he is the great protector. And the peacock will show its beauty. So it's kind of two completely different sides. The, the peacock stands in its own beauty. It's proud of its own beauty. And it will walk tall. So the message is that the angels want you to know today is that a surprise is on its way for you. 
But for that surprise to manifest, you will need to look for the unexpected. You will need to actually look for it. And this is something that you will not be at all aware of. A surprise is a surprise. It is unexpected. This isn't something that you've planned. This isn't the thing that's going to pay off. This isn't you manifest in your future. This is a unique surprise. In the true essence of what this word means. And it's going to be a nice surprise at that. Now this could be in the form of a new relationship. This could be in the form of a new job or promotion. Or the keys to a new property. Or this could be you dis spiritually developing. This is about self-transformation as well. And the absolute beauty of this card and the beauty of this gift and the beauty of this message from your angels is that right now you don't have a clue what that gift will be. How amazing is that? You are so lucky. What beautiful cards, group three. Remember, the angel of manifestation Stand your ground. Speak out. Your efforts and determination will pay off. You're being given the gift of willpower. You've got the archangels allowing the energy to flow naturally. Do not force any situations. And remember, you've got an amazing surprise coming your way. Bless you for watching. I hope that the reading did resonate with you. If it did, please let me know in the comments. Well, thank you all for watching my pick a card reading. If there is a pick a card subject that you would like me to cover in my readings, please let me know in the comments. Um, I do one of these readings every week, so I'm always looking for new ideas. So if there's something you'd like for me to cover, please let me know. If this reading didn't, resonate with you um, it's obviously general so it doesn't resonate with everybody then have a look in the description there are several other pick a card readings uh, yes no um who is my soulmate who's your spirit guide who is your animal spirit guide so take a look at those as well if this one didn't resonate and if it did please let me know as always please support my channel please subscribe Hit the notifications bell, like and share my videos and I am grateful. Bless you all for watching. I hope you all have a beautiful day.